So welcome back to Paris, Stade Pierre de Coubertin. Just one more match to come. Here on day three of competition. Second round matches today. And we are finishing with the men's singles. And it's the former world number one against the former world number two. The Chen Long, the Olympic champion, against a man who was promoted from the reserve list. But a former champion here, Jano Jorgensen, won the title here five years ago. Jano Jorgensen out for so long with injury, but wonderful to see him back. Now, uh, this match is from the top half of the draw. And we can see that the world champion, Kento Momota, the number one seed, safely through to the quarterfinal. So, too, is the defending champion, Kadambi Shrikant. My goodness, that should be a good match tomorrow. That top quarter of the draw. And in the bottom section of this top half, we have the Asian Games gold medalist, Jonathan Christie, against Sai Pranith. But we're going to concentrate on the reigning Olympic champion, the Chen Long, two-time former world champion, of course, up against Jano Jorgensen of Denmark. The Olympic champion, two-time former world champion, but he's never contested a final here, Chen Long of China. He was semi-finalist seven years ago uh, when he lost the eventual champion, Li Chong Wei of Malaysia. Yano Jorgensen making his eighth appearance here at the French Open. Won the title in 2013, beating Kenichi Targo in the final. In fact, it's been one of his best tournaments because he's been in two semi-finals as well, 2012 and 2015. But beset with a foot injury over the last 12 months, this is a welcome return to the centre stage. This is the 12th meeting between the two players of the previous 11. Okay. Chen Long has won nine okay. of them, including the last, which was in the second round of the China Super 1000 event in Changzhou. So as far as Jorgensen is concerned, one of only two Danes to win the men's singles title here since the inception of the Super Series, the other being Peter Gader in 2008. But Chen Long, he's 29 years of age now, born in Jingzhou in southern Hubei province. Former world number one, 75 consecutive weeks as world number one. Up two places in the world ranking on today's world ranking to number five, and he broke French hearts yesterday by beating Brice Levedez, the home player, in 49 minutes. So to Jano Jorgensen, who was promoted from the reserve list, replaced Anna's Antonsen, who a year ago was in the semi-final here. And after that heel injury, his world ranking, as you can see, has plummeted. So today, in the newly published world ranking, he went up two places to 29. A total of 63 weeks as world number two. 2015 to 16. And then at the end of 2016, the beginning of 2017 as well. Good first round win for him, Huang Yuxiang of China. Won the first on his fourth game point opportunity. 24, 22, 21, 17. As we look at our court officials for this, Sampa Berton, 
of from France and service judge Vernet, also of France. So the giant, the uh, Danish coaching bench. Ready to play. Kim Nielsen in the red shirts, Thomas Stango, and for the Chinese coaching staff, Charles Franzer is in the red tracksuit top, Chen Yu, the yellow. Well, didn't Ladies get to play last week, Jorgensen. On my right, Chen Long, China. And on my left, Janu Jorgensen, Denmark. Shen Long to serve. Love all. Play. So the reigning Olympic champion, Shen Long, getting his second round match underway against the former champion, Janu Jorgensen. Good opening rally. Well left. Well, just asks his coaches, one, should I have left no. an earlier one, I think? Last time they met, as we briefly saw, the scoreline was 21-10, 21-5 in favour of Chen Long. It was only 35 minutes in duration, that match, at the China Super 1000 event. Service well, over. just as well from Jorgensen's One, perspective. Two. Wasn't going in the right direction at all. Put away, but the clear from Chen Long was woefully short. Three, two. Over free all. Yeah, good body smash, jamming smash. Thank you. 
Yeah, trying the same thing, trying a, a jamming smash. Oh, magnificent angle from Chen Long. That is superb. Six, three. Mm, finds the line. Well, looking to make a milestone in his own personal career, Chen Long. Currently at 49 career finals. I'd love to get his 50th. Six straight points for the number six seed. Oh, my goodness me. Oh, what an exchange. Fabulous. <laughs> Tempting kill from Jorgensen. Didn't really go in the downward direction. 27 shots, and I suspect that might be the longest so far. Seven straight points. Oh, good return. What on earth was Chen Long expecting? Service over. Four. Obviously nine. a lift. It's not often you see him on his back foot after he's served. Service for called above the 1.15 meters. Ten, five. Yano. Lucky net call for five, Chen Long. Interval. And therefore he has a six point advantage at the mid game interval. Six point advantage for the number six seed. Robinson's coach. Oh, 
That's nice. Yeah, so too is the follow-up. Gets such an angle on that smash. Comes down so steeply. It wasn't such a bad lift either from Jorgensen. There's a tall athlete anyway, 188, six foot two. Challenge here from Chen, Chen Long. Long. Chen Long challenges called out. Oh, it clipped the line. Oh, that's extraordinary. Good challenge. Oh. 14, 5. Play. I'm not quite sure why Chen Long was apologising. He was the one that challenged the call. Both. Good return. Service over. 6, 14. Sacrificing power for placement and so effective. No power for Jorgensen to feed off on his defensive shot. This one here, maybe just a half smash. Serve. Yeah, it's the flick serve that did all the damage. 16, 6. Totally deceived, Jorgensen. doesn't have the same Six. speed around the court or ability to change direction as he used to have Jorgensen. Well, that's not surprising when you've had such a severe foot injury. It's gone too long. It's been caught again. Service over. Seven. Eighteen. Oh, well, that's just amazing to me. Why on earth is he going backwards? Why isn't he looking for the next shot reply? To be totally wrong footed twice, Chen Long. That is surprising. Hey. 
Kim. Service over, 19-8. Well, it's all very one-sided at the moment, isn't it? Jorgensen. Going for the acute angle. Service over. Nine nineteen. Seem to play to please uh, Thomas Stungle. Game point opportunities now. Service over for the Olympic champion. 20, game point. Overdone it. Again. Oh, we can get. Oh, there's a challenge here. There is a challenge actually. Challenge. Thank you. Yeah. yeah, it was a challenge. Good umpiring. Yano Jorgensen challenges. Called out. Spanish coach is a little quick on to court because there had been a challenge. But it is indeed out. Now they can come on to court. 21-10 opening game. So challenge unsuccessful game. Long 21 10. Formation of the scoreline 18 minutes and 21 10. Well, last week at the Denmark Open, Jorgensen was only on the reserve list and he didn't get to play in Go his TV, home event. 20 seconds. 
Sprout TV, 20 seconds. Which I know he found very disappointing. Second game. Love ball. Play. So the two time former world champion and reigning Olympic champion, Jen Long, getting this second game underway. statistic that has One yet to contest low. a world tour final his only final this year was at the asia championships in wuhan when he lost out to kento momota so never been in a world tour final It's a long rally. He finds the line. Oh, there's a challenge here. Ten long from Chen challenge long. called in. Yeah, clearly in. According to Hawkeye. Challenge unsuccessful. One challenge remaining. Service over. Well, that was indeed the longest rally of the Two. match so far. Love. 35 shots. Play. He was looking at his watch. Come on, player. Win quicker than this. I don't think that was the case. Oh, that wasn't even close from Jorgensen. Yet he appeared to be in good balance. Finds the line. Mm. A bit of slice on that, bringing it down very steeply. Thank you. Good play from Jorgensen. Service over, free all. Oh, that's terrific return from Chen Long on the net play. Free. 
Because it had been a tight spinning net shot from Jorgensen. Look at that one. He put vicious spin and slice on that. Look at this. Look how the shuttle was spinning. Magnificent. Net. Yeah, somebody using a flashlight. Play. Oh, he's done it. But... No. Who did she fold? Three. Go back on four. Thank you. Thank you. You blocked your open off. Go back on four. Thank you. Yeah, in fact, he's the one that touched it. Please. Thank you. He Thank certainly you. interfered with Chen Long's shot, and that's a fault. Good spot by the umpire. This is my return. Go back on court. Please, go back on court. Thank you. Go back on court. Of the body smash. Service over. Four, six. Straight down the Seven, line. Four. Inch perfect. Yeah, just seemed to snatch at that. Nine, four. Oh, left. Feel that he needs Five, to start closing down nine. this gap, Jorgensen, before the mid game interval here in the second game. Play. 
Okay. Oh, well taken. Oh, goodness me. Savvy Silver. Wasn't exactly Ten, a loose six. net shot from Jorgensen. In fact, it was a pretty good net shot. Look at this. Wow. Just launching himself to make the kill. Point he's hanging on is Jorgensen. But that's gone long. So a three point advantage for Chen Long here at the mid game interval of the second game. One game to the good as well. He's certainly determined, isn't he? Service over. 9-11. thing that slightly concerns me about Jorgensen is that he hasn't played many winners to win his points. Most of them have been errors from Chen Long. Well, I saw it as in, but the organs and obviously saw it as out. Hence the challenge.
Well, he hands the shuttle back. Challenge and only caught the line by a whisker. One challenge remaining. Service over. 12, 9. Play. Yeah, now that's good play. Service over. 10, 12. Great Service awareness, over. great spatial awareness Starting. from Chen Long. Ten. It's awfully easy when you're in those flat, fast exchanges just to uh, hit the shuttle. But he knew it was going long. Just got himself out of the way. Playing himself back Party. into the match, Jorgensen. Precision. 12, 14. by Chen Long. Smash down the forehand side of Jorgensen. And the angled shot down the backhand side. Yep. Perfect. Good return. Service over. 13, 15. That's a terrific smash. 
bided his time in the rally. Could be costly. I felt if he got back level, would have just made Chen Long think a little more carefully about what he was doing. Perhaps so a seed of doubt. Thirty-three shots. Service Too over. shy of the longest so far. Sixteen. Fourteen. Still thinking about that miss smash from Jorgensen on that previous rally. And he had a chance to make it 15 all. Smashed into the net. Mm. Hasn't won a point since. 18, 14. I'm still thinking about that smash. I only hope that Jorgensen isn't thinking about 19, that miss smash. 14. Opened up a five point cushion again. Getting long. Six point cushion, and therefore six match point opportunities 20 for the number six point. seed. Yes. One will do, and Jorgensen, after missing that uh, smash at 14-15, never won another point. 21-10. 21-14. Match one by over 43 Chen minutes. 21-10, And the Olympic champion threw to a third quarter-final here at the French Open. Yeah. His first Juggling. for seven years. Olympic champion playing himself very much back into form. 
Yeah. Oh, Congratulated by the fans <laughs> here in Stade. Pierre de Courbetin. 21-10, 21-14. So time for us to reflect on our second round matches uh, today, which all started with the defending champion, Tai Su Ying, uh, beating Gao Fangi in two straight games. Marcus Fernaldi Gideon, who's already won this title, he won the title five years ago with Marcus Guido, but now with Tsukamolio, the world number one, he's had to save two game points in the second game before closing it out against Endo and Watanabe. The world champions Cheng Shiwei and Wang Yaxiong were simply far too good for the Adcocks today, the European champions, from 5-8 down in the second game, 11 straight points, and that really uh, set them up for the two-game win. But then in the women's doubles, well, there was a big surprise when the European Championship bronze medalists beat the world championship bronze medalists, Frogor and Tuerson of Denmark, uh, beating Tanaka and Yoni Molto, 19 and 19. The former world champion, Ratchanuk Intanon, uh, two straight games against uh, Chen Xiaoxin in a little over 51 minutes. Xiu Qi, the former champion here, champion from two years ago, and reigning All England champion. Two straight games in a very one-sided match against Unkar Long. I suspected Unkar Long wasn't really very well. Then Pusala Venkata Sindhu, the world and Olympic silver medalist, had to battle hard for her victory over the left-handed Sayaka Sato. And as we've just uh, witnessed, the former world number one and a reigning Olympic champion, Chen Long, too good for the 2013 winner, Jan Or Jorgensen, 21-10, 21-14. So quarterfinals tomorrow, 3 p.m. local time. That's 1,300 GMT from all of us here in Paris. Until tomorrow, au revoir.